Hello and welcome to another video tutorial brought to you by Octotuts.com. The reason I'm making this video today is actually because of a user question from our Facebook page. A user asked, I was wondering what editing software do you use? And I answered their question, but I wanted to go a little further. Now before I move on, if you're not familiar with our Facebook page, it's facebook.com slash octosites. I'll provide the link in the video description below. You can ask questions, leave comments, and just pretty much talk on our Facebook page. So I answered their question explaining that I use ScreenFlow to record and edit my videos. I also went a little further explaining that I use iMovie for minor video projects and Adobe Premiere for uh, bigger and more important videos, but that's not the point. I want to focus on ScreenFlow for this video. Uh, you guys have asked me this question multiple times in the past, so hopefully with this video, uh, you guys finally know what program I use. I mean, it's always open when I record my videos. It's always right here. So ScreenFlow is a great program for both recording and editing videos. It actually makes the process very easy and simple. If you're not looking for uh, crazy effects or anything big like that, then ScreenFlow is great. In this tutorial, I want to teach you guys how to save videos in HD uh, using ScreenFlow. If you watch any of my tutorials, you'll see that they're all in 1080p HD. And this is all thanks to ScreenFlow. So I have a 31 minute tutorial open here. Um, this is a tutorial, I believe this is um, how to write the CSS code for a website. Uh, I have this open over here. And what I'm gonna do to save it is click on File. Oops, File Export. And let's save it to my desktop as CSS. And we need to customize the preset. So click on Customize. For the settings, we're gonna click on Settings, bring the quality all the way up to Best. Press OK. And for the size, we're going to change the dimensions from Compressive Native to 1920 by 1080 HD. And press OK. And then we're gonna press OK to that. And for the dimensions, click on Scale to Custom Size, and it should already have 1920 by 1080 HD already um, within the width and the height. And just press Export. Now this is gonna take a while because not only am I exporting in HD, but it's a 31 minute tutorial. But you guys get the point. That's what I wanted to show you guys. And you'll be left with a .mov file and you could just go ahead and upload that to YouTube. And there you go, you have an HD video. So that's it for this video. Very simple. I uh, just wanted to answer your question and uh, while I'm at it, I wanted to show you guys how to export in HD using ScreenFlow. If you guys have any further questions, you could take a look at octotoots.com slash fac, that's F-A-Q. And I have a whole page dedicated to questions that I get asked a lot. So that's it. Until next time, I will see you guys later.